Okay, so we're going to run the boil test on the little copper coil jet stove that I've made. So I'm going to boil 400 mils of cold tap water. I'll measure the exact temperature in a minute. Four hundred and six. Well, near enough for farm work. So while uh, I measure that temperature, we'll get the little stove going. This is the stove I've made. It's the copper coil jet design. Just using a little hotel marmalade breakfast jar. So let me get some ignition going with this. There we go. Doesn't take long to prime. So let's check the temperature of our cold water. And the stove gets itself busy. I'm going to use this titanium windshield a couple of stakes to support the pan and we'll time the test. So here's our water, it's at camera's not focusing, typical. And I'll tell you the, the water temperature reads 14. So, let's get the windshield around this little stove, set up our impromptu pan support. Lock up where we can see it. Okay, so let's start the clock. Put the 400 mils of water in place. And let's see how long it takes to boil. As you can hear, it's quite a busy thing, this little stove. Looks a bit of a roar, a bit like a petrol stove or a gas stove. Put 17 grams of fuel into it. Let's hope it doesn't use all of it. Quite a wide flame on it. Not quite sure why it's so busy. Maybe uh, we're getting a bit of gas coming out of where the copper pipe goes through the lid, so I might have to re glue that. Anyway, let's see how fast this water's heating up. We're already at 50 centigrade after less than two minutes.
75, 76. Eighty three ten stove no lid on the pan it'd be a bit more efficient if I had a, a lid but it's good fun to watch the bubbles isn't it it's hurrying up towards the boil four oh six the lap time there and then we'll see how much longer the stove runs before it starts to die. efficiently. For the speed it's working at, that's quite impressive I think. Is there doesn't seem to be any gas leak from around the where the copper pipe goes through the lid. And it just takes a bit of bedding in with the wicks, maybe, that are placed inside the copper tube. Yeah, it's going like a champ. So two minutes beyond boil. Getting towards the bottom of the fuel now. stove, copper coil jet stove. And that's it now, it's dying now. You can hear it's not roaring anymore. So it's just about used all its fuel. After 
eight minutes.